Hi, Curious Chicks here. Today we're going to do a video about hair extension clips. I was looking at a magazine the other day and there were just so many cool, funky hairstyles that celebrities have with the cool highlights and all sorts of colors and I was just wondering how they got that and I find out that it's hair extension clips, very temporary, very harmless. We bought some hair extension clips and the only problem is I don't know how to put them on, but luckily Carmen does, so she's going to show us how to do that today. Hair extension clips are usually made out of human hair and some people might think that's kind of weird, like you're putting in someone else's hair in your hair. <laughs> but um, it's actually the best quality to use. If you see hair extension clips that are not human hair, it's probably not gonna be, it's not gonna sit well in your hair. Um, it might um, degrade over time. It's just human hair will last a lot longer. Um, so this one, and usually hair extension clips come in a lot of different colors depending on what your preferences are. They can be brightly colored, or they can be just a nice contrast to your current hair color, um, or it can be close to your own hair color if you just want to add more volume. Usually the clips on the back, this will also tell you how good of a hair extension clip it is. If the clip secures very tightly and it holds the hair uh, very tautly, then that's gonna be good quality. And yeah, you want them to fit very securely because if you're walking around or you're just out and about, you don't wanna have to be embarrassed by these clips falling out of your hair. You're gonna want the, the style of the hair to be the same style as your current hair. Otherwise, you, if you flat iron your clip and your hair's curly, it's gonna look strange. It's gonna look very obvious that this is a clip. So you want the hair to blend in with your hair. You can put the clips either more towards the front so you get a lot of color more in the front, or if you wanna go all the way around the crown, then you can get a lot of color all around. Just take a section of hair from the top, and usually a comb that has this nice little tail end will give you a nice section. And you're just going to push it over to the side, okay, to the other side of the head. With the clips open, you're going to place it against the scalp as close to the scalp as possible and slide the hair in and clip it. Now some of them have one clip, some of them have two clip. It just depends on what your preference is. And we'll bring this hair back over and then just kind of drag your fingers through the hair so you kind of get a nice mixture of the extension and the real hair. As you can see, you can see the streaks of blonde just coming through a little bit. And that was just one clip. So if you have multiple clips, you can make it an even more drastic look by inserting it underneath that one if you wanted to. This one, I think it looks nice. It's just coming towards the front of the hair. It's not too much. It's like instant highlights. Yeah, it's instant highlights. They're temporary, so you can change it up. Like maybe today she wants to be blonde, and tomorrow she wants to be purple, and she wants to be a little funky. Maybe yeah. she's going to a concert or Ooh. going somewhere where she just wants to have a little fun. With the hair here, you don't see the clip at the top, and that's exactly what you want to do. If this hair was, her natural part was to the side here, then you would just see the base of the clip and that would look really strange. So make sure that this stays covered. You might also want to use a barrette or some sort of clip in order to hold it in place so that it doesn't move around. That's just up your per per personal preference, but um, it's just a way to make sure that the hair, the base of the extension is not showing. We continue it around the crown of the head. And move it to the front. Well, let's try a colored one this time. Ooh. Not that you're gonna do this. <laughs> so this one's kind of purpley. Bring that hair back around. And see, now you can see the purple color coming through. That's pretty. You want to get hair extensions that are close to the same length as your natural hair. If you have really short highlights and you don't naturally have layers there, then that's going to look a little strange too and look really fake. It feels good. 
like I don't feel, it doesn't hurt. It doesn't feel any heavier. It just, like I can't even feel them at all. So that's how you insert hair extension clips. And I think they're just a fun way to just add a little bit of color to your hair without damaging your own hair. And just a way to give your, your natural hair color a little color. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.